I'll talk to her. No, okay, that's not gonna happen. She what? No, I'll be right there. Good morning, my love. Good morning, beautiful. What's wrong? Nothing I can't handle. It's Jess, isn't it? No, well, yeah, but I'll talk to her. It'll be fine, just give her a chance. I am, but all of a sudden she's become this overachiever. Overachiever, I don't even know what that means. Well, she's gone from having no focus to being Einstein. Oh, Einstein, huh? She's made this complete 180 at work, Elle. Uh, God, I mean, she's got to board up with all of our schedules. Well, that's great, right? No, she has us working longer. She even signed us up for Facebook and Twitter. <laughs> okay, let me get this straight. You're upset because now you have to work harder? No, well, yeah. I only have a half hour lunch now. It's hardly enough time for me to sneak off and see you. Yeah, I think you'll figure it out. Good for Jesse. Good for Jesse, bad for Vince. Oh, did you just refer to yourself in the third person? That is so creepy. <laughs> Hello? Oh, hi, Rebe uh, Becky. Uh, yeah, I do have an opening then, so I'll see you then. Okay. What does she want? She, um, <laughs> she wants a reading. It's a trap, Elle. Why would you agree to that? Why do you always think everything is a trap? Don't answer that. She said that everything had worked out, whatever that means, and that she did drop the suit. Now what? Oh, good morning to you too, Vince. Hi, Barb. Hi. Oh, who's this? <laughs> wow. You didn't tell me how beautiful Ellie is. Oh. <laughs> and I'm her husband, Vince. Oh, this is Harry. He's my new sponsor. Uh, uh, nice to meet you, Vince. Woof. What a hunk. Look at those big, strong hands. Yeah, he's a mechanic. Ah, that explains it. <laughs> You're a very lucky woman, Ellie. Wow. Look at the time. I gotta get to work. <laughs> you don't have to leave on my account. Barb wanted me to meet some of her extended family. Harry's been in the program for 10 years. Wow, great. No lapses? None, I'm proud to say. <laughs> I think I finally got it right, Elle. I mean, he really understands me. Of course I do. I know what it feels like to have those urges to want to throw someone down and make mad, passionate love to a complete stranger in a kitchen, a bathhouse. That skin on skin. The heat, mm. the sweat. Mm. Oh, as you begin to take your clothes off, the next thing you know, you're pulling oh out the. Okay. <laughs> I'm starting to feel just a little bit horny here. On a one to ten, where are you? Uh, a six. Let me know when you're an eight. Okay. You have beautiful eyes, Ellie. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you know, they say the eyes are the windows to the soul. Amen. And let me tell you, that soul is primal, sexy. Wow, it's hot. <sighs> Vince, you must extinguish this flame in her. You'd be ashamed to waste all I that sex. I took care of that already. Wow, that vein in your neck just popped out. Huh. I'd love to be a fly on the wall when you two go at it. Oh, no, no, no. I wouldn't bother, Harry. They're not as evolved as we are. Ah, uh, they do it with the lights on. No, no, no. We do it with the lights on. So yeah, no. the nightlight doesn't count at okay, all. Okay, I've had about enough of this. <laughs> Too much normal for me. I gotta get out of here. Right. <laughs> I guess it was nice to meet you, Barb. Oh, wait. Be nice to Jess. She's trying, but you might want to check the messages when you get to work, because she sometimes forgets. What? I'm walking to the door now, leaving. Have a nice day, honey. Gee, I hope he didn't leave on my account. <laughs> so how did the two of you meet? Well, I was at the bathhouse, you know, and I was just being flung from the frying pan Right into the fire. I love the bathhouses. So many lost souls need saving. He sensed my struggle. I think I recruited about four people that night. God, I love my job. Barb, bathhouse, four people. Huh? He whisked me out of there and he's been by my side ever since. Uh, well, it's only been a couple of days though, right? Yeah, but you know my struggle, Elle. I mean, you know how I need to feel like a big Yeah, okay, <laughs> okay, <laughs> I, I get that. I understand struggle and stuff, yeah. yeah. I mean, but it's every day. I mean, every okay, day okay, I Okay, okay, I got it. Like... You know what, I have to go to work, I do. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay. All right, we'll see you later. Okay, bye, bye sweetie. Very nice to meet you. Ooh. You know, you should try it with the lights on sometime. It's mm -hmm. uh, 
so much more rewarding. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> I'm so glad we got over the misunderstanding about our last session, Rebecca. Becky, Becky. remember? Becky. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. And thank you for coming in here. It's just termites. <laughs> Tended. <laughs> Well, he was cheating on me. Mm. With, get this, my mother. Can you believe that? <gasps> That's awful. I set up cameras, I went to work, and there they were in our bed. Oh. I haven't been the same. I had to quit my job because I can't stop crying all the time. Oh. But I'm in therapy now. Oh. Oh, I have just the thing for you. Yes, I know. No, absolutely not, because she's an awful actress, if you can even tell her that. I have an appointment, I have to run. Who are you? Who am I? Who are you? I'm Becky. Well, Becky, you need to go. I need Ellie. Go. I'm not going anywhere. Go. No, go. I bite. Ooh. Oh, for God's sake. So I, I got this. Stella? Where's Becky? I got rid of her. I need you, and you know how difficult that is for me you, to admit. How could you, 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 you have no idea what you've done. My God, she just dropped the suit. She's a peasant. I need you to read my cards. OK, we have been through this before. You need to call first. Ellie, you're the best. Don't make me beg. Please, Ellie, please, please, please. Okay, 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 okay. I will read your cards only if you promise to call for your next appointment. I just don't understand why you don't feel that I am coming. No call, no cards. Okay, thank you. Shuffle and cut. I don't shuffle. Let's see what we have. Oh. Oh, there's someone, uh, someone from your past who's gone, but not forgotten. That could be anybody. Yeah. Oh, wow. This, this person meant a lot to you. Who is it? Wow. There is a lot of love around this person. You had a great deal of feelings for this person. And, and that actually caused some, oh, that caused some issues to, uh, wow. A long time friendship came to an end as a result. I don't have friends. Reshuffle the cards. No, this is what I'm seeing. Look, if you didn't want to read my cards, you should have just said so. I did say so. Okay. You came uh, in here. Uh, I was, uh, I was, uh, Kate, uh, you were, I, I, I am easy to communicate with. When you get it together, you'll let me know. You're losing your grip. Go on, your grip is in. Bye-bye. So, uh, you went out with a clown? <laughs> well, yeah, I guess, kind of. <laughs> He's really nice. Does he drive a clown car? No. Although, I did have him show up to the house wearing full makeup. I wanted to get Ellie back for all those jokes she played on me when I was a kid. Didn't go exactly as planned, though. Yeah, probably not. Bad timing on that one, huh? What do you mean? Well, Barb seems to think there's something wrong with Ellie. Well, she has been going through a lot lately. Well, maybe you should have a sit down and check on her. Yeah, God, I, f I feel really bad now. I just, I've been so busy with my own life. I know. You never call. You dump me for a clown boy. Shara. <laughs> Speaking of clowns, uh, have you heard the one about the two clowns that uh, walk into a bar and uh, they're uh, have you heard that one? Okay. How about the, the rabbi, the politician, and the clown? <laughs> They're all standing at the pearly gates and this guy with sandals walks. Jara, can we please just stop with the clown jokes? I mean, he and I are just friends. And besides, I am not ready for anything right now. I wonder if he paints a smile on his face right before he... <laughs> I, th I think that would ruin the mood. <laughs> and besides, it's been so long, I don't think I would even know... I've actually only ever been with one man. Uh-uh. Really? Yeah. I feel like a virgin. Well, you know what they say. If you don't use it, the, no, the, it's not a joke. 
There's cobwebs. If there's dust, Shara. there's it's all the left. Shara, a, that's crude. Will you please just stop? Stopping. <laughs> okay. How come you're not at work? Great. An even better topic. What? There's there's something besides bedtime with clown boy. <laughs> Where did you find that? In my pocket. Okay, well, there's no bedtime with Clown Boy. And I meant Vince, not Jason. <sighs> Vince? Um, dear God in heaven, tell me I, I'm misunderstanding what you're about to say. No. <laughs> you have a one-track mind. I mean, Vince is mad at me. Well, of course he is. He's mad at everyone. No, I'm serious, Shara. I think he's gonna fire me. Come on, pish posh. He's not gonna fire you. Yeah, easy for you to say. Remember my cocktailing days? You, you mean one day? Or a few hours? No, hours of madness. <laughs> well, just forget about it. Come on, let's go have some fun. I'll drink, you drive. <clears throat> Earrings. Hi, Bianca. Did you drive? I don't have time for this. Earrings? Oopsie daisy. <laughs> Here you go, pumpkin. Pumpkin? Thank you again, Bianca. Whatever. Oh, I heard your movie tanked. She's a really busy lady. <laughs> you know, right about now I'm rethinking the whole bitch thing. The... Yeah. <gasps>